Never I write, but if ever I write, I need the space to say whatever I like. Now just change clothes so when i was uh in italy we went crazy shopping i'm gonna show you some of these suits we picked up there in a second but it's funny because if you go back and you watch my videos from a few years ago i'm not wearing suits in any of them suits wasn't something i wore i'm wearing cutoffs i'm wearing gym clothing and stuff and uh, about two and a half years ago, I went to a seminar in Scotland with one of my mentors now. He's a billionaire. His name is Dan Pena. He's on YouTube. Crazy, awesome dude. And we have one-on-one -on -one coaching with Dan, right, for one hour while we're there. So I'm, you know, kind of like nervous. What, what are we talking about? Like, is it going to, like, really, you go into this thing and you're like, am I going to have some breakthrough moment here? Or is this going to be like, uh, okay, that was kind of helpful. So we go into his back office and he's sitting in his big ass chair and he's sitting back and you sit down on the couch and he's got two great Danes on the couch next to you so you already feel small. And then he goes, so how can I help you? And then the meeting starts and that's it. So we start talking for a couple minutes and he just stops me mid-sentence. He goes, and he goes, what are you wearing? And I'm like, what do you mean? Like to go to a seminar, by the way, you have to be wearing a suit. Like I never, never was a suit guy. I had to go buy a suit just to go to his seminar. So I'm just sitting there and I'm like, I'm wearing the suit you told me to, dude. Like I did what you said, right? And he goes, what was that suit? Like fucking Hugo Boss or something? He's like, you want to make more money? You want to help more people? You can't do it wearing shit like that. He goes, you only get one shot at a first impression and this is not going to cut it. And by the way, it was a Hugo Boss suit. Like, he's exactly right, right? He goes, you know what you need? He goes, you need a Tom Ford suit. Cost you five grand. You need a Tom Ford suit. You drive a nicer car, right? Because I, I, I never really cared about materialistic stuff. He's like, you got to do it. You want to make the money? You want to help the people? You got to, you got to present the image because we only get one shot of first impression. So I try to suit on and I love like nice, now I love this stuff. I'm wearing them all the time. So with you, I don't know what you're selling or what you're doing, but remember you only get one shot at a first impression. So uh, me and Natalie went to Italy a couple weeks ago and here's just, I got to get this stuff tailored now because what I do is I go there and I buy it and then I come back here and my tailor cuts it up. So like one, this red one was awesome. We got a bunch of shirts to go with the stuff. Uh, I got a white suit. We were in Capri, which is this island right off the coast of the Amalfi Coast. It's own little private island. You go there. There's pictures like Jay-Z and Beyonce shopping there. It's really cool. And the first suit store I walk into, this, this old Italian woman comes up to me and she starts flattering me and telling me, uh, you know, that I need to wear this suit or whatever. Check this out. This thing was amazing though. She made me try it on. I was totally, I, by the way, I'm such a huge sucker for flattery. I immediately gave into it. So this thing right here is just, oh. so it's going to go just like that, the white, oh, I think it's beautiful, it's pretty fresh, it's fresh dude, it's so, yeah, it's dope, and I, so the funny part is I start trying this suit on, and she takes out her phone, she starts recording me with it, and she goes, like, what are you, what are you doing, I told her, author, speaker, coach, she goes, oh, you're famous, I'm like, no, 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 trust me, I go, Jay-Z, like, the picture, that, that guy's famous, I'm not famous, she goes, no, 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 you're famous, you're famous, she records it, and then she, she, Freaking tags me in a photo, she posts it. She goes, Jason Capital stopped into our shop and she posts me on there. Uh, maybe we'll, I'll, I'll throw you guys an Instagram video, maybe we can cut it in there if we can find it. All right, so that was interesting, right? So we got this. And then of course you go to Italy, you gotta shop at the right stores, right? These are from, where are these from? Yeah, what's that say? Versace, so these are the Versace pants to go with, let's check this out. I think this one is sexy too. So these are the, the Versace coat. For some reason, not a Gucci hanger, but that goes with the pants right there. So, oh, suit game is stepping up. And then, oh, by the way, I know Pena was like, dude, you gotta get a Tom Ford suit. Don't tell him this. I only have one Tom Ford suit. I don't even like it that much. My favorite suits, personally, come from Dolce & Gabbana. That's just my favorite. So these two here, check these out. So we got one and we got two. Let's stack them. Oh. So the first one is this one, right? Hold on. Yeah. So I was like, you got anything lighter? He goes, I have something that's ice. I go, what's that ice? He pulls it out and I go, oh, ice. That makes sense to me. All right, so we got the ice, which is gorgeous. And then this one, I think is actually my favorite right now. And that's the DNG, don't think about it. Again, I don't know where your, your suit budget is at right now, but if you can go Dolce & Gabbana, dude, my opinion, the best suits that there are. So just remember, people do judge you. Whether you like it or not, they are judging you, uh, especially if you're younger, right? I'm 29 and I have clients who are in their 60s and 50s and 40s, dudes who have seen a lot, been through a lot, made millions and millions and millions of dollars. 
for me to be able to be an authority in their life and make an impact in their life, I have to audit what image am I presenting. I'm presenting an image that is gonna attract them, that is gonna be able to influence them. So it's important, man. You only get one shot at a first impression. What I would recommend for you is figure out who, what is my ideal client? Like get clear on who that avatar. And then the next step is who do I have to be in order to attract them and influence and impact them? Who do they need to see me as in order to make the impact that I wanna make? Something for you to think about here. Hopefully that helps you out. Um, we're gonna go to the tailor actually in just a couple minutes. So maybe we'll make another video at the tailor. Let me get back to the suits.